Hi, it's Tracy. Thanks for joining me. Today I want to show you how I created these paper bag purse gift cards uh, for my twin nieces. They're 10 years old and to all the girly things. And uh, Aunt Tracy just isn't quite, you know, knows what to get them. She has boys, so I thought cash would be the best. So let me show you the supplies that I used for this project. Um, some polka dot bags. I got them at Hobby Lobby. Some white rope jewels and white cardstock. I also have a three inch scallop punch, a two inch wavy circle punch, and the scallop dot border punch. I think that's Martha Stewart. So the polka dot bag I just laid flat. Just make sure that the flap is on the uh, top and then I just folded that in half. And then also what I did is um, I creased it in the middle so that it would give me a place where I knew my rope handle was going to go. And then I, where the fold is, I cut a V um, so I could have an opening in the one layer of the bag. I just want the one layer to have those two V marks in there and I'm just kind of showing you there with the arrows. And then I took the white rope and I just thread it through uh, one side of the bag. This rope is thick and so it wasn't going to be very easy to, to tie so I just taped it on the inside of the bag on each side so that it would make a handle just like I'm showing you here. Then I just took some glue and I just put it on all of the inside so that it would adhere together and then I forgot to take a picture of this, but the scallop dot border punch, I just cut that out using some white card stock and then attached it to the very bottom of the bag. This is going to be where like the edge of the bag will be, so it should line up with the very bottom of the bag. Now I'm gonna be working on the flap. This is going to be where my money is going to go. And so I'm just kind of showing you here how this kind of flips up. And so I'm going to put some adhesive on just the edges of the bag. I want to make sure that I keep that middle open so that I can stick in my money. Or you can use a gift card, but I just used some money. And then if you just fold over the flap, you can kind of see how it creates the front of the purse. Then I'm just decorating the inside. I just took a piece of white cardstock. I just took a pink ink pad and just inked up around the edges. I just added a piece of ribbon, just some silver ribbon. Then for the scallops, um, I decorated those up. As you can see, I just, the pink, I just ink some white and then um, the white I inked up pink and then just put some pink dots in each of the scallop. All right, the K and the M is from the Storybook Cricut cartridge. And then I'm just showing you here, I hot glued a jewel to the front of the purse to kind of finish that off. And I also added a pop dot for the closure, that way it could be open and closed easily. All right, this is the finished K purse that I have, and then this is the finished M. I just love the way they turned out. And this is how the money fits in there, and a gift card would fit perfect in there as well. Thanks so much for watching everyone. I appreciate all of my fans and followers. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel if you haven't, and leave me a comment. Bye!